Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video, I'm going to show you a method for trimming surfaces um, in order to get more than just one edge on the trim surface itself. For example, we've got a sketch. Uh, I want to trim this curved surface here with this sketch. So we just simply go up to trim surface using our standard trim. The sketch becomes our trim tool, and I'll elect the uh, portion to remove as uh, the inside here and we're left with a hole. Now my intent is to have um, more than one surface edge here. You know maybe I'm gonna do some further operations and I, and I want to have this uh, single edge of the surface broken into maybe four quadrants. Now uh, I could do uh, split lines on the surface but I don't want to really split the surface in that case. I just want the edges split. The secret to this <clears throat> is that if you go back to the sketch and edit the sketch um, and split your actual sketch entity into four pieces, uh, the easiest way to do that is tools, sketch tools, and we'll just say split entities. We'll split at one, two, three, and four quadrants. Now if we did that right, we should have uh, four pieces, let's verify, two, three, four, and that will translate to the surface trim and very nicely give us one, two, three, four edges. So, so pretty subtle. That's the tip. Remember that. That will help you in your surfacing. Thanks for watching this quick tip video. My name is Tim Roberts. Mm -hmm.